I already put the Floet Troll in the cups. I'm going to try something a little bit different today. Something that I haven't done before. So bear with me on this. I'm going to mix our colors. Good. We're going to do yellow. I'm going to do this combination before, but, and I'm going to use a little bit of baby oil today, too, to try and get some of those cells, so, we're going to see what happens. So, I mixed those colors, and then I thought, I'll get a big cup, fill it up with some Floetrol, and I'm going to do a lot of white, that's going to be my main white, and then I'm going to add some... of this uh, extreme glitter white to it. Extreme glitter white. And then I'm going to do some metallic white as well. Is it frozen? It's not that cold. There we go. Maybe I'll add some glitter. I'm not sure. Okay, so we're going to mix all those whites up in this floetro. Because I plan on using this for a lot more than just mixing with the other colors. colors mixed up. I'm going to start, I'm going to do two cups today. And I'm going to start with a little white at the bottom of each one. Then I am going to do blue Gonna do some red. Kind of turned out a little bit pink, but it'll do. And then I'm gonna do some yellow. And then a little bit of green. And hopefully this comes out good. I'm also adding a little bit of baby oil. Just a couple drops. To see how, how that plays out. Then I have a needle for my cups. And... What I'm going to do is flip cup this, start out with the one, and then the mixed up white that I made, I'm going to pour on around it like that and then I'm going to spread it around pulling out cups here maybe a little more Okay. And I'm 
going to take my pin and I'm going to poke the bottom of the cup. And then I'm just going to smear it around through the white. That's so pretty. I'm going to pick it up and I'm going to move it around. I really like those blue cells in there. Okay, so that looks pretty cool. Now, I'm wondering if I should pour or flip. And I'm thinking I'm going to flip. Actually, you know what? I'm going to pour. Okay, let's see what that looks like. Let's move it around. Okay, pretty good for now. That actually looks really good. So then on spots that we're not really fond of, like this spot here, not really fond of that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to pick up some of the colors that we lost. on the bottom and I'm going to lay them right like that Ooh, that's pretty I need to do the corners too because a lot of the corners need to have the color coming down. Oh, that one's nice. came out pretty good. I'm actually really um, happy with this piece. And I'm liking it. Okay. Looks good. Now if we move it around a little. Let's see what happens here. Okay, let's lay this, sit this down while I go get my torch. And we can torch this and see what we can get out of the cells.
Now that is what I like to see. Try not to get you all covered in paint, but... pretty good. What do you think? Nice, huh? I really like the detail. The sides came down nice too. 